y'all welcome back to my channel so today we are doing another makeup look but with no foundation i am basically just doing my eyebrows eyelashes and a little bit of concealer under my eyes this is a quick look if you just want to go out i know for the summer days it's kind of too hot to be wearing foundation so i kind of do this all the time because i still you know want to be on fleek whatever you want to call it but yeah, so right now I'm just underlining my eyebrow with the Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade in the shade Dark Brown. My eyebrows aren't thick, so I don't need to get them like waxed or threaded a lot. I kind of already have a shape, so I kind of just go off that. So right now, I am going in with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. I do not know the shade, but I know it's exactly pretty close to my skin tone. That's why I'm using it. So right now, I am just basically underlining my brow again. Well, following my eyebrow shape, cleaning up the brows, basically. And for this look, I will not use a concealer lighter than my actual skin tone because it'll look like, I don't know, you look like a clown. I don't know. <laughs> So I'm just using a color, a safe color that's close to my skin tone. And yeah, cleaning up the brows. So right here, I am going back in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade in the shade Dark Brown. It's on my hand, so I was kind of dipping and dabbing, but I am kind of fixing what I kind of went over with the concealer, fixing my brows, adding more, taking away, whatever you want to call it. And I am adding more concealer to my eyelid for more coverage. I'm not putting on eyeshadow. I just don't want my concealer to be blocky under my eyes. So right here, I am buffing out the concealer that I put. I'm not spreading it. I'm not moving it in circles. I'm kind of just patting it so that it'll sit and stay in place. So right here, I took a damp sponge that I had, and I am basically using that to clean up the excess product around my eyes from the concealer. So right here, I am setting my eyes with the, I believe, Revolution or um, Banana, I don't know. It's setting powder that I use, and I use it to set my eyelid. And this is going to prevent, like, creases and folding of the concealer that you put in your eyes. So just to give it a better, clean look. So 
Right here, I am going in with the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Orange, I believe, not red. And I am putting this under my eyes to clean up the dark spots that I do have before I put on the concealer. And right now, I am prepping my lashes. I'm kind of just letting my concealer sit. I like for it to get tacky. I feel like once it's tacky, it'll make my concealer stay in place and it allows for it to get more coverage once I spread it under the eye. I feel like the worst part about me recording is once I do record, I feel like I always forget something. So I know I went in the room to get the fan so I can help speed up the process of my concealer kind of drying. And yeah. And right now I am spreading the concealer under my eye, giving it more coverage, hiding my dark spots or sleeping bags, whatever you want to call it. Right now, I am going in with the same concealer I use under my eyebrows. I am using that to conceal under my eyes. In the meantime, while I am letting my concealer dry under my eyes and kind of get dry and tacky, I am putting mascara on so my lashes blend better when I apply them. Now I am going in to blend my concealer out. I am not spreading it, moving it in circles. I am simply patting and bringing it out under my eye. So to set my eyes, I am using the same Revolution, I believe banana something shade I use to set my eyelid. I'm using that to sit under my eyes. So right now I am putting on my eyelashes and y'all, I be struggling because my eyes water a lot. So when I put them on, my eyes water, and it's kind of bringing up the glue. So sometimes I can put them on with my fingernails or tweezers, but I struggle. And you can see now I am struggling. So right now I am just removing all of the excess powder, setting powder under my eyes and I will be taking my Orange Beauty Blender again to just blend everything in, make it all come together. So right now I am taking a black eyeliner pencil and I am using that to go under my waterline. I feel like using this makes my eyes pop and they are also like three, four dollar at the beauty supply store. And I am also using my mascara to make my bottom lashes pop. I sue anybody who has long bottom lashes because mine's are very little and it takes a lot for me to have them pop out.
Now I am just using that same concealer brush, same concealer shade that I used to conceal under my eyebrows and under my eyes to just clean up the extra mascara I went crazy with. Now I am just taking my Morph Continuous Setting Spray and just setting everything. So right now I am using my MAC Chestnut Lip Liner and I am just outlining my lips. And for a look like this, you don't even need to outline your lips, but it's my go-to every time. So right now I am just putting on a clear gloss that was in my Morphe and Jeffree Star collection. It's a really good clear gloss and I'm just putting that over my outline lips. So guys, this is the final look. Just eyebrows, concealer, and eyelashes with some clear gloss. This is something or a go-to look I would probably go for in the summer. So I don't have to wear foundation. It's too hot for that. But I hope y'all like it. Like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media, which will be in the description box below. Bye.